Hello Aries, welcome. I'm Ryan. Thank you for being here. This is going to be a general reading we're going to be dealing with. Of course, everything may not resonate. Stick with does and leave the rest. And for more tarot readings after this, please check out my wife's channel, Rob D3 Tarot. She should be for you as well. Thank you. See what's going on. Couple more and I'll jump into this. Hmm. All right, and there you are, Aries. Um, one more. Oh, geez. Goodness gracious. Okay. There's clearly some. There's clearly some sort of interaction or dynamic here between the two of you being played out. But jumping into this right away, they do show me a strong focus on themselves. Now, whatever is going on, I feel like they are having to make very quick, decisive actions regarding their own personal circumstances. This is definitely focused around finances and who they are and what they're accomplishing and kind of have done for themselves. I do see that given the financial circumstances, they are kind of having to move forward with things and just kind of accept and lean into this, even though there are difficulties there. They're kind of saying they're, they haven't stopped believing in the positives, the positive results that could be, that could take place. Um, or maybe it's an energy of kind of, you know, fingers crossed for what might come up next or what might be up ahead. Huh. It's very interesting. It almost kind of seems and it feels like hmm. There's definitely an adjustment period that they're going through. Whatever that adjustment period is, they're saying, when is it time? When is it ready? When they'll be ready? When it's interesting. Maybe they're waiting on a life year. I don't know. But it almost kind of seems and it feels like when they feel, they're kind of saying that when they'll, they'll do something or start something when they themselves individually feel called. But it seems like there's, it's because of the interaction are you, Aries. Um, it's kind of like who they are. Maybe they kind of left you on red or kind of ghosted you or swerved you. I don't know. But whoever, like, the way they present themselves is kind of like they're a busy person. It's kind of, <laughs> I don't understand that. They're a busy person. They're clearly a, you know, quote, somebody. Um, and that's what's very interesting is it's almost kind of like they're, they're perceiving you, but it almost kind of seems like energetically they have to even energetically prepare themselves mentally and emotionally to approach you. And that's what I find very fascinating is this energy of kind of self-containment or holding some oneself back to literally go for and approach you, Aries. They, they show me that they're not too sure exactly how this is gonna pan out or how things are gonna unfold through this interaction or through this approach, if you will, towards you or to you, but they're definitely doing it. And that's what I find very interesting is something goes on and takes place here where there is that approach but they're they're highly stressed out about this and i don't know why it's almost kind of like they're they're doing it they're doing it and all it's like they like they 
they hype themselves up to go forward with this and then all of a sudden it's kind of like you you appear aries and they're kind of like oh shit they can't kind of they can't keep their shit together and it's like okay we'll go with it we'll go with it for now i don't know what that is um Oh, geez. Yeah, they, they can't. What'd they do? What'd they do? Yeah, I don't know what that is. They, I don't understand that. Yeah, they, they, they approached you. They clearly approached you. <laughs> what? I don't understand how or why. It's like, was it like within the workplace or something? And it's kind of like, can't right now, gotta go to work, or I don't know, but. Wow. Wow, wow, wow. Wow. It's how they perceive, oh goodness, I was gonna say, it's how they perceive you, Aries. It's how they perceive you. This could have been within the workplace, work environment. That's interesting. They're still trying to chase Louise. They're still picking up to the, <laughs> they're still picking up the pieces till this day. <laughs> and I don't mean to laugh at this. It's just kind of like, what are they doing? I, I feel like it's within the workplace of the work environment. Could be a coworker, colleague. I don't know. But like I said, they it, it's almost like they approach you at work and find out like, oh, Aries is all about business. Aries is taking themselves seriously. And it's like they, they have, it's interesting. They cause a scene or a mess for themselves, which is kind of like, well, I guess they found our answer. And they're saying, you know, well, then fine. It's interesting. They're kind of like, you know, brushing off their shoulder and, you know, getting the dust off and saying, I don't care. I don't care. Um, but yet at the same time, they're, they're doing everything they possibly can to move forward. And that's what's fascinating is their idea of moving forward, Aries, is once again to reapproach you. It's like they shot their shot. It was rejected. I don't care. I don't care. I don't care. And now they're wanting to approach you again, Aries. But for some reason, it's in the energy of how they, like I said, how they perceive you. It's like they, they clearly see you as the prize or of some sort of value. But I'm not even too sure exactly about what, because for them, they're choosing, you know what, let me kind of just commit myself to my work and my, my whatever it is, my work, literally, um, and figure out what to do later about this. And it's kind of like, okay. So they approached you, you rejected them or turned them down. They're doing everything they can to move forward, but at the same time, it's kind of like you left some sort of effect or impact to them that is still kind of ringing in their ears. Um, and they're trying to kind of scramble and come up with something quickly. And I don't know exactly what that is, but they're saying, uh, great, let me, you know, let me go home. Let me kind of sit with my thoughts. I'm going to sit with my emotions and kind of figure out what I feel called to do. Um, and that's ultimately what they're doing is they're, they're making some sort of plans. But again, I kind of feel like it's to reapproach you again for something. I don't know what that is. I don't know if it's going to be about, you know, hey, how's work? Or if it's going to be, hey, um, <laughs> or if they're going to try again and kind of see where this goes romantically. I don't know. Um, we'll see. But of course, if you are dealing with anyone, you could be dealing with an earth sign, an air sign, a fire sign, or a water sign. Goodbye.